Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time clicking on one of my videos, my name is Amanda. Today's video is all about spring outfit inspiration. So it is the ultimate guide to spring outfits for 2020. I wanted to let you guys know that this video is in collaboration with Lulu's. So thank you so much to Lulu's for sponsoring today's video. I lately have bought a ton of things from Lulu's. I bought a dress I wore to a wedding recently from there. I bought a ton of winter staples, teddy coats, really cute things. And now they're starting to get more of their spring outfits so I've got a ton of things I want to share with you guys so without further ado let's get started first tip for transitioning your wardrobe from winter to spring is to incorporate florals into your wardrobe so this is a print that I absolutely loved I found this mini dress on Lulu's and I got it in an extra small so that I could wear it more as a shirt instead of a dress still kind of cold in Texas right now so I still want to dress warm but add more colors and patterns into my wardrobe that are spring appropriate and kind of give you that spring vibe so this was perfect my second tip and probably most worn trend for myself is to start incorporating distressed denim into your wardrobe my favorite like spring summer staple outfit idea is to put high-waisted distressed denim with white t-shirt and that is exactly what I'm actually wearing right now I absolutely love just a basic white t-shirt with high-waisted jeans and it is really hard for me to find a pair of jeans that fit me like super well I'm always so picky with jeans and only have like a select pair that I get from like the stores I know are gonna fit me well I decided to buy this pair from Lulu's and they fit me amazing they're high-waisted which is really good they're just dressed a little bit in various places but it's like very lightly it's not too much and then there's one hole on the left knee which I really like I don't like too many holes in my jeans I just like one or two and then they are straight leg which is super super flattering so you can wear this with a booty or with white sneakers or something like that to dress it up I put this oversized blazer on over my outfit which is perfect because it's still a little cold outside and I just throw this on to dress it up and I think it is adorable blazers are something I search for I really really like blazers I like them to be oversized a little bit and this one was perfect it looked a little bit oversized so I just bought my regular size and I'm glad I did because it fits perfect I can cross my arms and not feel like it's gonna like bust in the back I feel like that's the tip like you have to cross your arms and if you still have room in the back then it fits good so this one was like a check in my book with simple outfits like this I really do like to add more accessories than I would with maybe like a floral dress like the outfit before so I added these really cute gold hoops they're super adorable I really I really like gold hoops if I'm ever wearing earrings they're usually gold and they're usually some sort of hoop so these were great to add to the collection and then I got this really cute scrunchie that has a tie on it during the spring and summer it gets hot obviously and my hair is curly mess so I like to put my hair up usually in a low bun or a high bun or something like that and I feel like this just kind of dresses up like the hairstyle that would normally look maybe a little bit messy on me with super curly hair. My next tip for transitioning your wardrobe into spring is to start incorporating lighter colors into your wardrobe and steer away from the blacks and the browns that you would probably wear more of during the winter. Yes, it is still cold outside, which means I'm still wearing sweaters. So I got this really cute white sweater from Lulu's. I just thought the peplum detail on this was adorable. I don't have any other sweaters that are like this in my wardrobe and I'm glad that I can start bringing this with me as we transition into spring I wanted to give you guys another idea for wearing lighter colors these are white pants the belt on this is tortoise which is adorable wanted to share these with you just for another white option and the pants are completely lined so they have an insert in them and you don't have to worry about them being see-through or anything like that next tip for transitioning from winter to spring is to have at least one staple jumpsuit in your wardrobe I really like jumpsuits especially when it starts getting warmer outside because you're not wearing a ton of layers jumpsuits are super breathable this one is khaki which is adorable you don't have to add a ton of accessories the jumpsuit speaks for itself and this one is so so cute just pair it with a pair of sneakers and you're good to go this will definitely be a staple in my wardrobe and you guys will see it again very soon the very last tip for transitioning from winter to spring is to get a very good 
durable pair of white sneakers i have i think three pairs of white sneakers in my closet but honestly guys i really don't buy that many shoes here is a little close-up of them i think they are adorable i can't wait to wear these and i have like a few other pair of white sneakers i wanted to share with you guys these are obviously a little worn i wear these with pretty much every outfit lately as the temperatures get warmer i will definitely incorporate them into a bunch of different outfits so when it comes to winter obviously you've got your boots and your booties but you can't bring those into spring and summer so i like to wear white shoes white sneakers in particular because they go with jumpsuits jeans midi skirts midi dresses literally everything they help just kind of bring an outfit together and if you're more casual like me it's literally perfect thank you guys so much for watching this video i hope this gave you a bunch of outfit inspiration to bring into the new season if you guys aren't following me on instagram that is where i have a ton of outfits i usually share what i'm wearing throughout the week and everything's always linked there so follow me on instagram if you're not already everything from this video will be linked down below and i will catch you guys in the next video bye